Hello everyone, welcome back to Global Trade Plaza's channel on international trade finance. In today's video, we will be discussing one of the most crucial aspects of international trade finance, which is methods of payment and trade finance instruments. When it comes to international trade, it is essential to have a reliable and secure method of payment. This is where methods of payment and trade finance instruments come into play. These methods ensure that both parties involved in the transaction are protected and payment is made securely and on time. Let's take a closer look at some of the most commonly used methods of payment in international trade. Cash in advance, this method involves the buyer making payment in full before the goods are shipped. This is the most secure method of payment for the seller, but it can be risky for the buyer as they may not receive the goods if the seller fails to ship them. Letter of credit, a letter of credit is a document issued by a bank on behalf of the buyer, guaranteeing payment to the seller once the goods are shipped and the terms of the L, C are met. This is a secure method of payment for both parties. Documentary collection, this method involves the buyer's bank collecting payment from the buyer, and releasing the documents needed for the goods to be released to the buyer. This method is less secure than a letter of credit, but it is more affordable. Now let's take a look at some of the trade finance instruments used in international trade. Bank guarantees. A bank guarantee is a written promise from a bank that payment will be made to the seller if the buyer fails to meet their contractual obligations. This is a common form of security in international trade transactions. Export credit insurance. Export credit insurance protects the exporter against the risk of non-payment by the buyer. This is an important tool for exporters as it allows them to expand their business into new markets without the risk of non-payment. Factoring. Factoring is a method of financing where the exporter sells their invoices to a factoring company at a discount. The factoring company then collects payment from the buyer and pays the exporter the remaining balance. In conclusion, methods of payment and trade finance instruments are crucial in ensuring the success of international trade transactions. By understanding and utilizing these tools, both buyers and sellers can protect themselves and ensure that payment is made securely and on time. Thank you for watching, and we hope you found this video helpful. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more videos on international trade finance.